I'm a creator. I couldn't wait any longer, y'all. I got it. All right, what's up, y'all? So check it out. Just picked up the MacBook Air with the M1 chip, man. Woo! I've been wanting to get a new computer for a while. I was trying to hold off until the 16-inch MacBook with the M1 chip or the iMac came in. And actually, I just found out that that chip's gonna be an even higher upgrade, uh, the M1X or M2, whatever they decide to call it. But uh, I just couldn't, I just couldn't wait anymore because uh, my computer, psh, man, I've had this thing. Sheesh, man, I've had this thing for over 10 years. And I got it to uh, edit my first music video, the first one that I produced and put together and filmed and all that back in 20, late 2010 and early 2011 and uh, I needed to get that so I can get Final Cut to cut it up with and uh, and then I just had it all these years doing all these videos and all that and it's just it's, I'm at this point now where I just need something beastier and uh, so I've been hearing a lot of crazy things about the M1 chip so we're gonna find out what it is today I'm gonna do some comparisons and uh, show you guys what the old one is talking about and what the uh, air m1 chip do so uh, yeah man so let's get to messing with these uh, computers and see what it do let's go all right you guys check this out this is the craziest thing to me this computer has the touch ID so I just put I got the fingerprint on there boom I don't have to put my password in that is wild I love that. Okay, so uh, this is gonna be the first test. I, I've got some footage transferring over on the hard drive I'm gonna put on the air. It's taking forever. This was, let's see, 52, 52 gigs from this project. It's gonna be a total of 35 minutes. We'll see how long it takes to transfer it over onto the air. But uh, I just uploaded some footage here, some of this B-roll. <laughs> let's see how this goes. So this is 120 frames a second. I got it in a variable frame rate from 24. And uh, so there's a lot of stuff going on here. Let's see how this goes. Okay, so far so good. It's playing smooth, no skip frames. I got it on full resolution. Oh man, yo, this is crazy. This is insane. It's uh, man. Oh yeah. Oh, I think we in there. Oh man, I'm getting excited. Okay, here, check this out. So let's go. Let's go full screen. Oh man. Yeah, that's pretty, look at that picture. Yo, I'm really excited, you guys. My old computer would have never have done this. This, I didn't have to render anything. It's the, uh, it's 1080. So we'll see how it handles this 4K. But dude, transferring the footage from my old MacBook to the hard drive, the external hard drive, took 35 minutes. Same folder, same project, everything. Coming over to the air, nine minutes. Nine minutes, y'all. Okay, it's four times faster. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Oh my goodness, jeez, yes. <laughs> y'all don't know, man. Okay, check it out. So I got my old MacBook in the air. You can see the screen's bigger, but uh, and the quality's right here. <laughs> it's the size doesn't matter. I got uh, an external monitor too. I might hook up with this, but I could still do my work on this thing. And eventually I'm gonna be upgrading to the 16 inch, which is bigger than this one. So, uh, all right, so I got the same clip. And when I put the adjustment layer, which is where you add like the color correction and all that, on here um you know usually like how i did on this one when you put the adjustment layer on i get that red in there meaning it needs to be rendered it's gonna be running a lot slower i've never experienced this still yellow i'm still good that's insane on full screen modes you can really see it and the display looks way better too man like way cleaner display oh man look this is already lagging it's already lagging Choppy on the left, choppy. And uh, the air is smooth. This is a 120 
frames a second and uh, slow-mo dang dude that is crazy so let's do a render test it's off here oh yeah man this is definitely reading a lot faster I hit this one a little bit afterwards it's already double I'm at 10% there on the new one old one 4% and I hit the old one first oh dude this thing's way faster on this export I'm already three times faster 17% this is 6% man come on that's crazy this thing so a five minute this is five and a half minutes this will probably take hour a couple hours this is already a quarter of the way done so there you have it you guys crazy crazy I'm excited man I mean time is money and sitting around and waiting for things to render or just waiting for the computer to catch up it just uh, it takes forever to get these projects done and honestly a lot of times it's just not very motivating I just you know I don't want to go into a project when I know I got oh, to deal with this and the lag and the processor and uh, too much I need to make this thing happen and, and uh, not stifle my creativity and just go try and work as fast as my mind can create and uh, yeah, man, so I love it. MacBook Air M1 chip, let's get it.